Hi, I'm kind of sick today. <coughs> <coughs> What's up, cuties? So welcome to our channel. And next week, guess where we're heading? London and New York! <coughs> Both of our trip is actually for work. And yeah. it's going to be really short, short. But we just decided to hold a meet and greet to see yeah. our cuties. Because there's not going to be many chances for us to go to New York and London. So yeah. we've got to like take all the advantage. advantage of it possible. <laughs> so all the details of the location and time will be at the end of the video. So make sure to stick around with us till the end. Yeah. I'm so excited to see you cuties. Oh my god. So I, I know a lot of our cuties are BTS ARMY. Army. Aren't you guys? So as you guys know, BT Cosmetics just released their BT21 collection. So they collaborate with BTS. We knew that we had to review these. Because I know so <coughs> many of our cuties want us to review these. Yeah. Here's the collection. Well, it's not full collection, oh. but... As you guys can see, we don't have our cheek and our lipstick right now because mm -hmm. we actually want to try those on camera. So let's try to do it because I need some cheek. So cute! Oh my god! So these are chick cushion. I never used chick cushion before. So number one is raspberry and number two is papaya. Number three is guagua figs. Ooh. They say it has a lot of moisture. Shuki and this is raspberry number one. So cute. You just put it on one finger like that? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, it's like hot pink. Isn't it? Does it show any oh, color? Yeah. Very, Very subtle. subtle. Whoa, you gotta, I gotta do more. Very moisty and dewy. Wow. It's actually very cool. Mmm. Smells. Uh, yeah, it smells like raspberry. Yeah. Number two is Koya. And this is Papaya. Oh, look at this. Oh, oh God, I like that one. Okay, this is like a coral. Yeah, coral orange, color. orange color. I think I'm just gonna use my finger. Sanitary. Like that. It grabs more um color oh, when really? I do like that. It shows so much better the color. Okay, look at yeah. that. That was a raspberry. Yeah. I think the raspberry, generally, the color is very so. subtle. Ooh, papaya smells like papaya. Can I do it? Okay. This one's bang. Number three, fig. Here you go. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, that's a little like a dried rose, rose color. color. And wow. that's like a hot pink. If you like pink and you want a little more visible one, I recommend this one. Is that Ooh, cool? this is like an MLBB lip color. Uh, oh, I like this one. Yeah, this one's pretty. Let me try this one. I like this color. See that? Yeah. Okay, take it back. I guess it's kind of different when you swatch it on your yeah. um, hand and then swatch it on your face. Yeah, it's building up. The color's building up. Yeah. I can tell. Then let me just try this thing. For me, I'll try number two, papaya. <gasps> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, this, this one. This is ooh. the color that we always yeah. use, right? Ooh. Okay, okay. This yeah. one's good. This one's good. Ooh. Okay, no more. Do. Okay, no more. No more. <laughs> And it's very light. Because like when we use a cream, I can feel that little heaviness mm -hmm. when I put it. Because it's dry. Uh-huh. Oh, I like this one. This is my favorite. <gasps> my favorite now. Oh. Okay, no more. Okay, here's our recommendation. If you like orange color, then definitely go for this number two papaya. I'm sure a lot of cuties going to like contemplate whether you should get number one. Number one raspberry or number three the fig. Because they're, they look kind of They similar. are on the same pink hue. But if you want like that useful pink, like bright and and outgoing pink, then definitely go for this no, number one raspberry. Uh -huh. But if you want that romantic pink, mm -hmm. then go for this one, which number is number three, big. Mm -hmm. Okay, next! Or glow lip lacquer, but in Korea we just call lacco. Lacco. Yeah. So these four are, um, it gives kind of a shimmery, glowy dewiness. Mm -hmm. There's another set that looks just like this, but they are matte finish. Very pigmented and matte. Number, number one, pure co coral. Number, number two, two, pop orange. orange. Number three, awesome pink. And number four, potent, potent red. red. Ooh. So we're gonna try number one, pure coral. Look how cute the shape is. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Whoa. Yeah, so these one you can kind of build up the colors yeah. and do like a gradient. gradation. That's what I like. Number two is pop orange. Okay, here's how it looks. Cute. <gasps> oh my god, that's pure orange. orange. <gasps> Almost like a neon orange. <gasps> ah, they all smell so good too. Yeah, their whole theme is like a fruity color mm. and smell. And smell. Number three is awesome pink. Oh my god. Look, look at it. It's not amazing. Look at this one. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, it's like a raspberry pink. Yeah. Holy oh. crap. Okay, this is my favorite color. <gasps> wow, all these colors are so bright. Ah. Ah. Mm. Their pigmentation is crazy. Yeah. And number four is potent red. It's a little heart. Oh, oh, heart. So cute. <gasps> oh my oh, god. <laughs> it's like blood. 
up. It's not like pure red, but there's a little bit of orange. Red orange. orange. Yeah. It's number one and number four. They're on the same red hue. Mm -hmm. But as you can see, number four has so much more pigmentation than number one. If you like a pigmented red, definitely go for four. But if you want that like glossy build up red kind of color, then go for number one. And this one is kind of like a it's like a fuchsia, fuchsia color. It's yeah. not like a bright pink. Yeah, it's fuchsia. like kind of purple pink. pink. Yeah. Yeah. And number two is coral. So if you like yeah. orange, go for that one. <gasps> I'm oh. through today. So which one do you want to try, sister? So I'm gonna try number three, awesome pink. Oh, <gasps> oh my god. Oh. Hey. I like this color. It makes my lips look big. <laughs> oh, that is so pretty. Oh, that's a really pretty color. Oh, it goes well with my um hair. Yeah. Mm. Pop orange. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. One swipe is enough. Oh, still wow. a lot. That's pretty. One tip for small lips like me that has an anus lips. I call it spaghetti. You kind of smudge it over your lip line. It has an illusion to make your lip look yeah. big. That's how I do it. I call it spaghetti lip line because it looks like you just ate spaghetti. Ooh. 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 A thumbnail. One, two, three. Ooh. Okay, so now let's start the... Okay. The cream, of course. Ow. I can't. <laughs> Okay, now it's a cream lip lacquer. So number one is nudie brick. Is like an MLBB color? Maybe. Like a, like a nudie color? Yeah. So this is how it looks like. Oh, yes. yes. Oh, something like, that Kardashian yeah. will do. <laughs> oh. It's not like dry matte. That's oh, yeah. Sure. It's not dry yeah. matte. Yeah. Number two is vanilla pink. Okay. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, oh. so oh, this one's like a dry rose mm. color, right? Yeah. Ooh, my wow. favorite color. It's like a pink, but they added a little white on it. So ooh. it's like, ooh, very creamy pink. Three is mellow coral. Oh, this is so cute. We just keep saying <laughs> cute. Everything's so cute. Oh, okay, can you what's try the difference, difference with this? Yeah, let's yeah. see the difference. Ooh. Oh, so this pink has a little more coral color. Mm -hmm. Number two is like a creamy pink. Number three is coral pink. Mm -hmm. It's so pigmented. I actually like this one better. <laughs> I like everything. Okay, the last one. Number four is syrup red. <gasps> oh, holy shit. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> wow, this what? is legit red. You should try this. Uh, I'm so scared. But my lips are so small. It's like gochujang. I'll go with nudie brick. <gasps> oh. 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 oh, it feels so velvety, sister. Yeah. Oh, so creamy and velvety. I'm gonna make a spaghetti. Oh, you're gonna hurry try it. It mm -hmm. feels so different from the first um, one. The lip color, Korea. Vanilla pink. Oh, mm. that's a pretty mm. color. That's like my lip color. You see? Can you can you feel it? Whoa! Right. What? But as it dries. Mm, okay, at first matte. it feels so creamy, like it's gonna get like swipe off, but it got dry and now it feels like I didn't put anything in my mouth. Syrup red. Okay, syrup red, but my sister so wants me to try it for mm -hmm. some reason. <laughs> that was pretty. Mm, that one suits you. Told ya. Number one, two, three, four. If you want the Kim Kardashian new lip, definitely go for, go for number one. one. If you want that creamy, Pink. pink. Go for number two. If you want a coral pink, that's kind of like M O B B. Go for number three. Mm. And if you want that jet red, mm. go for number. But four. it's really not that jet, jet red. red. It's like a orangey red. red. Yeah, this, this is the one that she's doing. Yeah, this yeah. one, like that one. <laughs> if you guys prefer a dewy matte that literally doesn't erase, if you go like that, use the cream lip liquor. On the other hand, if you like that glossiness and a color that you like to build it up, then use this glow lip locker. Okay, so now let's go for the palette. I'm so excited. This one is mood brown and this one is mood indigo. Let's do the okay. number one mood brown first. So there's a lot of like earth tone. Oh my god, oh, circular shape. Oh my god, oh, so cute. Oh, it's this, this way. Oh. oh my god. Whoa, there's a lot of shimmery. Mm. These are all shimmer. These are all shimmer and this one's just a matte color. Yeah. This one is mood indigo. Ooh, these are more earthy tones. Mm. This one's called Mood Brown. Yeah, and this one's Mood Indigo. Oh, oh, 
They switched the yeah. package. That doesn't make sense. Yeah. Cause that is more like okay, <laughs> mood. This was brown. mood brown. Yeah, this is mood indigo. Now yeah, that, that makes, makes sense. sense. Yeah, so a lot of earthy brown tone here. Personally, I like the mood brown palette. Yeah, these more. are more usable for daily mm -hmm. makeup, and these are more for like parties or outgoing. I'll try the darkest one. That's a chocolate brown. <laughs> Ooh, okay. I get it. And that one is glam orange. <gasps> but once you put it on your skin, it's not that crazy pigmented color. It's very subtle. So here's the mood indigo. That's a blossom pink. What? Can we see it? Lavender mocha. I think that's the darkest yeah. color from this palette. Whoa. Yes. Pink moon. That was something I'll put on my Ooh, inner tear duct. Yeah. Oh. Wow. Photos and shine. Photos this and is shine. literally white, like white shimmer. Oh yeah. Ooh, it's like a mermaid seashell kind of color. So if you want like these bright highlight type of colors, mm -hmm. make sure to go for number two, Mood Indigo. And if you want more of the earthy and kind of daily look makeup, something that can easily do it, yeah. go for the Mood Brown. And I personally will go for Mood Brown. Yeah. But here, I like these kind of colors to do it on my ear tear duct. So now let's review the cushion. There's two different types, water cushion and cover cushion. So water cushion is more like a dewy, finish. glowy finish and cover cushion is literally like you want to cover it yeah. up and they say you don't have to wear um. concealer so this one's a water cushion so cute Ooh. <gasps> mm. cooling Ooh, this one does good job on coverage too um, cheek here let me try covering it <gasps> see that yeah Oh, the coverage is really good despite that it's a water cushion. But at the same time, it's very dewy. Okay, let me try the cover cushion then. But right now, because Korea is so dry, we prefer the water, water cushion. cushion. This one's also 21 Ivory. Boom. Oh! <laughs> it's a concealer! Whoa! Yeah, I can tell this has more a little more coverage than yours, yeah. right? You see the difference? I'm back. A final review. The water cushion is very dewy, but the coverage is still very good, mm -hmm. despite that it's a water cushion. So if you have a really dry skin, go for the water cushion. Yeah. This one. It's basically uh. just think as if you're putting a concealer In as a face. foundation, but it's not heavy. heavy. But again, if you have a dry skin, go for this one. Because mm -hmm. still, this looks it looks very mattifying. Uh -huh. yeah. So I think it would dry it out. Wow. Thumbs up, five stars out of five. Yeah. So now we're going to review these lipsticks. Eight different shades. Yeah. Number one is Brow Dun. Oh, it's like a little giant pill. pill. So cute. So cute. Oh. Oh. Wow. wow! It's very soft and high pigmented. And this is number two, stunning coral. And also this size is such a good size to like bring it around. It's yeah. like a very portable size. <gasps> Oh my ah. god, this is like you try here? pure orange. Oh, oh. it's like a wow. bright orange. Yeah. Number three is mood rose. Ooh, Ooh. it's kind of similar with the number first one. one. Is it? It's more. Can I see? This one is more like a coral pink. Mm. This one's more like a brown, brown pink. Number four, bunt pink. Whoa! Okay. Uh, here we go. <gasps> oh. okay, this is our mom's favorite! It's like a bright pink. Bright pink. Oh, yeah. Number five is deep orange. Wow! Whoa! It's almost like a red orange. Number six, red pull. I haven't seen any colors that are like jet red so far. Mm -hmm. Everything has a little mix of orange. orange. I want to see some jet red. Oh, oh I, I think, think it is! is. Oh yeah, <gasps> pure red. red. Number seven red. is burgundy sin. Oh, that's like, like a, a dark, dark red. Blue. Oh yeah, this is dark red. We usually call this vampire color. Mm -hmm. Number eight is struck pink. This is like a fuchsia, right? It has kind of like purpley pink. Mm -hmm. They look so smooth when you apply it. Yeah, yeah, it's very smooth. Hi, I'm kind of sick today. <coughs> 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 so I'm gonna try struck pink, number eight. Wow, mm, it's so soft. For me, I'm gonna try number one, brown done. Ooh. All these colors, you kind of need to build it up. Uh -huh. And I like how you can kind of smudge it easily. You know what, this is my favorite. And they're so moisty, moisty. Mm. So the last one is tinted shimmering luminizer. Oh. oh. 
I think it's something that you put on your base before you do foundation. Act it as a primer. Yeah, act it as a primer and kind of even out your skin tone. It has a kind of a color to it. But it doesn't cover. Huh. It doesn't give any coverage at mm. all. Oh, it's very dewy. Oh, it smells, smells so nice. nice. Yeah, so this one is used to even out your skin tone before you put your foundation. Mm -hmm. And it says to shake it before you use it. I think it's good for a uh, winter and fall. When it's super dry. Yeah. Oh. Here, it looks like this. Oh, it smells so good. So that's it. And for me, I personally am so amazed by this cushion. It's gonna be one of our favorite cushion from now on. So if your cuties are interested on these products, we'll put the link at the description box below. So yep. make sure to check it out. Yeah. So now here are the details to our meeting and green at both London and New York. Ah! Can you believe we're going to London, sister? No. I mean, I knew that we we're gonna go to London, New York, but not this fast. Yeah. We're going to London because we have some work with Nylon Magazine. Yeah. And we're going to New York because we're going for the H&M and Most Chino yeah, collection um, launching party. Yeah. I'm really excited to see Jeremy Scott. And, and the, the Beckerman, Beckerman sisters. sisters. They're twins too. Oh. And I know that they're a huge supporter of Jeremy Scott, Scott. So I'm pretty sure they're gonna be yeah, there. They're gonna be there. Let's go and say hi. I don't know. I'm gonna be so, I'm gonna be so shy. Say hi, okay? Yeah, obviously she's gonna make me do it again. So I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyways, I'm so excited yeah. to see our cuties. Me too. So let's announce London first. The meet and greet for London is going to be on October 20th, Saturday at 5 p.m. We're going to stand outside the Westfield London Mall. Yeah. And there's this huge um building called John Louis. And in front of there, there's like a stairs, a little bit like small stairs. We're going to stand over there. Yeah. So we're going to hold a meeting group for about an hour. Just a really quick and short one just to say hi to everyone. Yeah, and so see please come and say hi. So it'll be from 5 to 6, so make sure to come. Yeah. <laughs> so for our New York meeting group, we're going to be holding the meeting group at 25th on Thursday from 5.30 to 6.30 p.m. Mm -hmm. And we try to do this on the weekends, but unfortunately we're going there during the weekdays. I really hope cuties who have works can show up to our meet and greet because we really want to show you you guys but finger crossed that you guys can come and for the location we haven't decided yet yeah but by the time we upload this video we'll finalize the location yeah so please check out the description box mm -hmm. for the location uh -huh. oh, oh, actually right over here this oh, is yeah. gonna be the location yeah right here so oh my god this is really happening going, but it's like a really tight schedule because right after we come from london the, the next, next day, day we have to go to, going new to new york so like gonna be a long flight <laughs> <laughs> yep, so hope you guys enjoyed this video yeah. and we'll see, see you guys, guys tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye bye.